Galaxy Crew. Lavi here. And as I promised my little mint pin prince, the chameleon is here with me. He is very spoiled. He had his first birthday party a little while ago. A lot of doggy friends showed up with their humans. We celebrated with lots of doggy games with prizes and a piñata filled with tasty treats. His cake made with special ingredients for dogs was enjoyed by all his four-legged friends. It got so many gifts. Lots of toys and snacks and enough cool outfits to be the best dressed dog in the neighborhood. He kind of has a toe and finger obsession, so if you ever meet him, guard them with your life. He has a lot of nicknames like Snuggle Buddy, Love Bug, Troublemaker, and Supply Bandit. Yes, I am sad to say he is a thief. He steals the Q-tips I use for my eyes, water bottle tops, and slippers which are his favorite. Sometimes he even tries to steal them while they are still on your feet. A fun fact about Prince is that he actually graduated valedictorian from puppy training school. Who am I kidding, he graduated with a D, but that is beside the point. He graduated. Well Prince will say bye for now so I can tell you about the various AAC devices I have used over the years. First I will start with the way people communicate with me. They type on an external wireless keyboard and it shows up on my device. This is because I lost my hearing and I also have low vision which I will go more in detail about in a later video. Everything on my device is in large font due to my low vision. I will have my nurse Daisha type something to me so you can see what I mean. Well Prince also types to me by walking on the keyboard, but I have yet to find anyone who can translate what he says. Hi everyone, so I'm Levy's nurse Deja, and this is the external keyboard we use, which is what I will use to type to him. Hold on one second, and I'm going to move the camera really quickly. How it works is, hold on. How it works is I will type to Levy on his screen and as you can see he has big letters because of his low vision. Once again I will use this keyboard and I'm just going to type Levy, um, hi Levy, how are you doing? And then Levy will clear his board. And he will type his response, whichever response he wants. He also has pre-generated responses, as you can see, like yes, no, I know. Hold on. And his response was okay. And that's it. Now he's clearing his word again. Nice to meet you guys. Bye. I will start with my first device, which I had many years ago called a Delta Talker. It took a while for me to get used to it since the message window was too small for me to see. And I couldn't hear the message, but eventually I got pretty good at it. The next device was a Pathfinder, which was a definite upgrade from the Delta Talker, but it was still a bit hard to read the message window. Then I found the TELUS at the ATIA conference. I was finally able to see what I typed. It also had other capabilities but it was one of the first devices with certain features like text messaging etc. So, it had just a few problems that had not been solved yet. This was many years ago and I am sure all those things have been fixed by now. The representative for the company was helpful and nice to work with. Then I got a comm link which was great in many ways. The only problem was the power didn't last long and that created a problem when we were out all day. We were always trying to find an electrical outlet. Then I found the Toby device. 
The battery lasted a long time and you were able to buy extra batteries that you could switch when they died. The only problem was it had glitches when working with the grid software which is my software of choice. So now I have the Winslay device from FRS, which is my favorite by far. The battery lasts a long time and with an additional external battery, the power lasts even longer. I also like that it is lightweight and grid works perfectly on this device. So for now I'm happy with my device. I can email and text and it has many other great things that I will get into another time and demonstrate for you. FRS technical support is great and Smartbox the maker of the grid software is very helpful too. I have one additional wish for the makers of all these devices and that is to be able to change the tone of a word or put emphasis on a word or a sentence so we can sound a little less like a computer talking. For example if I say, I am very happy. Do I sound very happy to you? Well, let's see what the future brings. Please leave a comment or email me if there is any special device you want to know about or if you have information to share. I will definitely let everyone know. Here is today's joke, what do you call an alligator in a vest? And invest to gator. <laughs> Please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time, AAC Crew.